Chancellor Olaf Scholz defended the German government's position on migration, foreign and economic policies in the Bundestag on Wednesday ahead of his meeting with the European Council scheduled for Brussels at the end of this week. Scholz stressed that he is open to speaking with Russian President Putin but said he would never make decisions about the future of Ukraine over the heads of the Ukrainians. On the topic of tensions in the Middle East, he reiterated the need for a ceasefire but said that Israel would always have Germany's support. He said that Israel can rely on German weapons deliveries but underlined that humanitarian aid for Gaza is needed. The German leader warned that Iran is playing with fire regarding its attacks on Israel. Scholz also promised to meet with Germany's top business associations this month with a view to solving German industrial problems. He criticised the EU's new tariffs on Chinese electric cars and said that Germany needs to build the best cars and compete globally. With the German federal election scheduled for autumn next year, it seems like Scholz and his government face an uphill battle to turning the promises into reality before then. Liv Stroud, in Berlin, for Euronews.